It was nearly 15 years ago today that my beloved wife Penelope was abducted by aliens. Richard, she can't do that. I don't know. We played <laughs> hooky a few times. Oh, oh. shit. Oh, no, that's right. The hell? Can you see? No, I can't see. <laughs> And as always, I dedicate tonight's broadcast to my beautiful angel in the sky, Penelope. And we're all tuning in tonight because we have one thing in common, a traumatic experience we simply cannot explain. I want to thank you all for tuning in to the True Encounters broadcast. Good evening and keep on believing. In the dark. I really don't feel comfortable with you sharing our personal experiences with a bunch of lunatics on your podcast or radio show or whatever it is you do, Dad. Just stop by to see if you'd like to read uh, some of the good book with me. No, no, that's no time for that right now. Buster's sick. I can't believe I'm saying this, but Richard Wilkes is one of the sheep. Seized? Oh, God. I mean, what else can go wrong? Buster comes in. He's wagging his tail, and he's healthy, and he's feeling good, right? And then, Buster, the greatest miracle of all. I can walk! But me and the boys, we think that they're coordinates. Coordinates. What the hell? You're not going anywhere unless it's with me. What's a man of the Lord doing with a gun? Turns out my good pal Steve is a government agent. And I was right the whole time. Oh, please, please! Oh. I'm gonna have to take both of you in. How do a 110 pound girl get the best of a uh, killing machine like yourself, Agent Wilson? Try not to lose it this time. Come on out! Let's talk! No one's here to hurt you. We just need to get that thing on your arm checked out. Huh. This 